Hey guys, in this video I'm going to show you how to run Python 3 code using Sublime Text. Now if you're using Sublime Text on a Mac and you run Python code, you're going to notice that it runs Python 2.7. If you want to change that to Python 3, there's a couple steps you need to take. So the first thing I want you to do is to make a file. I've made my file called sample.py and make sure you save your file as a .py extension. If you don't do this step, saving your file as a .py function, it's not going to work. Okay, so that's the first thing. After that, you're going to come to here, Tools, press Build System, and go all the way down to Python. Usually Sublime Text would have automatically selected Python uh, if you've saved it as a .py file, but just make sure that it's selected. Now you won't have Python 3 there. I'm going to show you how to add Python 3, but first we're going to use Python, okay, and that's what you should have. Now type import sys print sys dot version. This is going to print the version of Python that your Sublime Text is running on. And then press command B, which is a shortcut to build a code, or you can go to tools and press build. Okay, and so now it says 2.710. Now we don't want 2.710, we want our Python 3 to be running. In order to do that, we're gonna go to tools, build system, and then we're gonna create a new build system. Once we're done creating that build system, you're gonna get Python 3 here. So go to new build system, and you're going to come to this uh, window. So what you're going to do is erase this code here, and you're going to replace it with the code I've given you in the description. Okay, so go to my description, take the code there, and then paste, and this is what you'll get. And this is basically just looking for the source of your Python 3. After that, you're going to save. So press Command S, save, and give it a unique name. Uh, call it maybe Python 3. That's what I've done. Right? Or you can call it Py3, whatever you want. And then it's going to be a dot sublime, so Python 3, a dot sublime build extension. And don't change the directory. Usually it should come to uh, the standard directory. Uh, under user and uh, it knows where to go so you don't need to do anything and then you press save I'm not gonna press save in this case because I've already done it but that's what you would do once you've done that it should appear under build system okay and then you're gonna select Python 3 right so again make sure your build system is Python 3 okay cool and now run the same code command B bam Python 3.74 Hope that video helped you guys. Good luck.